So, let's start with the basics. Both Linux and Unix are operating systems. You can think of an operating system like the brain of your computer, it helps run everything from your apps to your files and manages how your computer works. Unix is the original brain, it was created way back in the 1970s. It was mainly used by big companies for things like servers and workstations. But here's the thing, it was not free. You had to pay for Unix. Now, fast forward to 1991, and here comes Linux. Think of Linux as an open source, free version of Unix. It was created by a guy named Linus Torvalds, who wanted to give people a free operating system with the same awesome features as Unix. Okay, now let's compare Linux and Unix in a way that's super easy to understand. First up is cost. Unix is like a fancy, expensive car. You've gotta pay for it, and it's only available to big companies or for very specific tasks. Linux, on the other hand, is like a free, customizable car. Anyone can download it, install it, and use it without paying a cent. Next is where these systems can run. Unix is limited, it only works on specific, usually high-end computers or servers. Linux. It's everywhere. You'll find it on personal laptops, cloud servers, mobile phones, and even smart refrigerators. Who's using these systems? Unix is mainly for large companies, financial systems, and specialized environments. Linux is for everyone, from big companies to students learning coding and even you and me. Linux powers everything from Google servers to the Android phone in your pocket. Here's a fun one. Unix is owned by companies. Different versions of Unix are developed by different companies like IBM and Oracle, and they keep it tightly controlled. Linux. It's built by the people. Developers from all around the world contribute to Linux, and because it's open source, anyone can modify it. So, which one should you use? If you're just starting out or want a flexible system that works on everything, Linux is your best bet. Plus, it's free. But if you're in a specialized field or working with enterprise servers, Unix might be what your company uses. Thanks for watching. If you found this breakdown helpful, hit the like button, share this video, and subscribe for more DevOps tutorials and tech explanations. See you next time.